Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to design a mug in the design editor. Today I'll be showing you this white ceramic mug, the 11 ounce one, but if you'd like more specific instructions on how to design any of these metallic mugs, the black mug, or the glass mug, stay tuned for future videos. This video will be about how just to generally use the mug template and produce a nice design. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the item. And here's the product page. As always, we can go look at the product info tab. This design can be one-sided or two-sided. It's 100% white ceramic, dishwasher and microwave safe. The design file info says that we do need to upload it as a JPEG. This is super important for those of you using Photoshop or some other external design software. Our printers don't necessarily like having transparent backgrounds. Since our printers don't print white, I would recommend using a true white background regardless of if you want a white background or a transparent background. Do not export it as a PNG, only JPEG super important. Um, other things to note, these are the file dimensions. If you're using Photoshop or something, just make sure they follow these, these guidelines. All right, let's go ahead and design. As you can see, this template does not look like a mug. It's just a basically a rectangle, but it does show that this design is two-sided. Each of these crosses represent the middle of each design if you were to just hold the mug straight out in front of you. This non-principal area is where the handle would go. So if you ever need help figuring out which side your design is going on, just imagine that there's a handle right here. So this is going to be the side of the mug that you'd be looking at if you're holding it with your left hand. This would be the side of the mug you're looking at if you're holding it with your right hand. Um, another thing to note is that there will be about a half an inch on either side of the handle that will be white just due to our printing limitations. So even if you pick a red background or something like that, you still will get that small little white strip. It's not a big deal, but for this mug, I'm going to keep it transparent. Okay, one more thing of note is this safe area. The safe area is this orange line right here. If you're doing a full bleed pattern that goes all the way to this blue line, make sure that you don't have very intricate small details on the mug. Past this line, there's no guarantee that those small details will come out clearly. Okay, let's get started on designing. I'm gonna make a real simple design just so I can show you the basics of what we're doing. So this red cross is gonna represent the middle of each side of the mug. On one side of the mug, I want it to say, coffee please, and I'm gonna put that in this font called Great Vibes. I'm gonna put this centered with that cross and then just make it large enough to really center on that side of the mug. So if I'm holding it with my left hand, I'm gonna look at the words coffee please, but on other days of the week, I have this attitude of coffee now. Maybe it's a Monday vibe. Um, go to layers, there's my coffee please, add text again, coffee now on the other side i'm gonna use this font called frederica the great and again put an enter here move it to the other side of the mug and center that right there nice okay that's all i really want if you want a full tutorial on how to use the design editor we do also have that on our page but yeah so i'm gonna go next and yeah this looks great if i do want the same design on both sides this is what i could do so i'm going to delete that for now go here click duplicate and then just move it so that i have this design replicated on both sides of the mug now when i click next you can see that coffee please is written on both sides so there you have it that's your mug go ahead and click save design Here's the mug, 11 ounce. You can edit the product name or product description however you want. Just go ahead and click save and open. And there you have it. There's your mug. Thank you for watching. Tune back in for more videos from Printed Mint.